need to make sure I need to, okay. That's, that's, that's Holy problem. Spirit stuff right there, I'm telling yes. you. I'm, okay. <laughs> You ready for this? I'm ready for this. <laughs> is it ad? Here's, here's the reason. See, this is why I'm like, I don't like stop it. Because yeah. anytime you be saying some stuff, man, yeah. go ahead. Here's the reason why there's a lack of solutions in our culture. There's a lot more people who are um, trying to avoid liabilities instead of create solutions. Hmm. So I'm kind of an out of the box thinker. So right. I've learned this the hard way. When I create a solution for something, that works. When I create a solution for something, it works. It's a solution. Yes. There's always somebody there who says, you can't do that. Actually, code 3.1 section 2 says you can't do that. And, 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 and I'm sitting there like, well, why not? You're pushing it. Do they always wear glasses? <laughs> no. Do they no, 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 no. No, LASIK eye surgery. <laughs> no. Well, something could go wrong yeah. there. <laughs> right. Yeah, no, there. I tell you what, there's, there's people who um, are motivated by creating regulations. There's something wrong in yeah. their psyche. So they create regulations that keep you from making progress. And I say you, I mean, think about the no, people I... we're gonna be working with. Uh, think about people who have real obstacles in their life. There's something in their psyche that says, there's a regulation, you can't get around it. The only way you're gonna get around this regulation is through my good graces. And they're setting right. themselves up as God. Right. I'm the keeper of the regulation, so you gotta treat me the way I wanna be treated or else you're never gonna get, like, hold on a second. <laughs> Man, where the spirit of the Lord is, there is liberty. Yes, absolutely. Not regulations. No. <laughs> so I tell you what, God is trying to move through faithful people in this day who are active in social work. They're active in legislation. They're active in churches that are full of regulation. God, he wants to use people to create processes that lead to pathways of freedom. Uh, and, and so we need some faithful people to step up and say, I've been duped in the past to think that I wasn't the right person for the job, but now I can see God's putting a word out to me. I am the right person. It's just that the, the group think, the majority think of our culture was making me think I wasn't the right person. But if you know you're calling, you know, God's calling you to do that, get out there and do the job that God called you to do, create pathways to freedom. But are there enough pastors? Are there enough? In other words, does the world need another uh, whatever ministry that somebody feels that they're supposed to do? Does the world need another? Another whatever. Church? Another does the world ministry? need another church? Does the world need another ministry? Does the world need another rapper? Does the world need another singer? What, don't we have enough? No. <laughs> no, no, absolutely not. Um, there's, there's not enough people who are leading. This is what you have to understand about leading. <clears throat> okay, today in our world we have leadership that happens through movies. We have leadership that happens through mega churches and people watch pastors on screens and stuff like that. You have all this big, broad outreach leadership, but the greatest leadership we need is person to person leadership. That's where the real life change comes from. Um, so we need people who are local music producers. Um, yeah, you should try to go big. Yeah, you should try to go national. But you have to understand um, the relationships you keep around you is where your most dynamic leadership happens. So let's get out there and do the things that God called you to lead. He, he's, called, he's called us all into a priesthood of believers, right? So uh, that doesn't mean that we're all pastors, <laughs> but that means that some people are singers and some people are teachers and some people are social workers or uh, some people are business owners. In each of these circles of influence, you're a priest, you're an ambassador for Christ leading people. So yeah, get out there and do it. There's not enough, there's not enough leaders out there. Do you know how much I appreciate you speaking 
not just on the video to me, but I can sense what my audience is gonna feel. Cause no one that I know has said it the way you said it right here. This is some powers. This is like, I just got, I just got kingdom gold right here. Right. <laughs> you are now listening to nm3dots.com Free download